Creator Studio is here, and with it comes a new, curated experience of creating simple apps on guardrails so that truly anyone can start building on ServiceNow. Jake is a manager with a rapidly expanding team. To date, his team has exceeded their goals every quarter. Jake wants to officially reward them and provide gift cards as part of that recognition. However, securing approval for monetary awards is an intricate process that can span hours and involve repetitive interaction with many systems and upper management. To tackle this issue, Jake decides to check in with his IT admin, Lola, and requests the process for gift cards. She's happy to help Jake make his own end-to-end -end app, drawing on his business process knowledge. So, Lola adds Jake to the Creator Studio users group in their sub-production instance. Time for him to get started on a simple app. Jake rapidly builds out the foundation for his app by following Creator Studio's templates. Using the step-by-step -step guidance, Jake creates the foundation for his app in just a few minutes. He decides to use the default template, which already comes with pre-built questions. Jake gives the app a home in the service catalog under the finance category. He then designs the simple form as an intake point for new recognition requests by populating a few easy questions. Creating fields like the gift card amount and the recipient all comes to fruition in a matter of seconds. When he needs to add another question, it's as simple as dragging and dropping one onto the form. Once Jake is happy with the form he's built, he marks it as ready for review. Next up, it's time to build a quick playbook to execute approvals on the back end. Hopping into the Automation tab, Jake leverages a simple designer experience to create a playbook that acquires approval from his manager as well as finance. When the need for more sophisticated functionality is required, Lola will be able to add external integrations to help fulfill the gift card requests. Satisfied with the form and automation, Jake previews his app to see how it will appear on different formats like the portal or on a mobile interface that mimics the real experience. The submission process gives him a chance to double check that his app contains all of its necessary elements, such as the form he created and marked as ready earlier. Once Jake submits the app to IT for review, Lola can track its progress through App Engine Management Center. After Lola puts the app through their development pipeline, Jake is able to see his app's new home in his HR Center homepage. As his team starts to use the app, it saves countless hours for Jake and lets him focus his time on building their marketing team. The final element is the Creator Studio workspace. Each form submission Jake receives will end up here. The cool part about this is that every single Creator Studio app is going to reside within the same workspace, which takes away the overhead of maintaining multiple workspaces across the business in tandem. The beauty of Creator Studio is that IT's backlog is reduced by allowing business experts like Jake to address his own needs through app development. Jake can get started in Creator Studio, but developers like Lola can help advance his work in App Engine Studio, or even ServiceNow Studio in the future, creating a better experience for everyone.